Hi there, I'm Heidi and welcome to my channel. Now if you're wondering what this contraption is that I am sitting on, it is the TerraGlide. I did do an unboxing of this new toy and you can check that out above. It was a while ago, so I promised you this video for probably over a month now or something. So you're finally getting it. I'm a little bummed. I do have to say that this guy has so many little bells and whistles, but the wheels do not roll across carpet very well, which I didn't really think it was going to, especially if there's weight on it. So when I get a chance, I'm gonna take this into the studio where there's some hardwood floor, and we're gonna do a really cool workout, Pilates-based workout, using the TerraGlide with the uh, wheels. But today, we're just gonna use the dome, and then we're gonna flip it over and use the handles and challenge our plank cork. So I hope you're excited, it's gonna be fun. This is a long intro, so let's get started. All right, so we're gonna start this Pilates-based workout seated on the front edge of your Terra Glide. And what's nice is that it kind of sits in a rectangular shape, so you're gonna have more support for your back when we eventually get down there. So there's your forewarning. So you're gonna sit right at the front edge, sitting nice and tall, take your hands behind your thighs. Let's just start with some pelvic tilts. You're gonna curl that pelvis under, rolling back, feeling that dome underneath that sacrum, and then we're gonna restack, sitting nice and tall. Try that again, exhale, we curl. And then inhale, just lengthen. Sitting upright, finding that posture, one more. Make it about the pelvis, not so much about collapsing in the upper back. And then restack, sit tall, and then take your arms out in front of you. Do that again, roll it back. And then lengthen, find your posture. Now, what if we take a contact point away? As we curl back, can we draw one leg to tabletop position? Feel how that balance, that feedback works into your, your movement there. We're gonna take it back down, restack the spine, and let's alternate that going into the other side, lifting the opposite leg up. Woo! Bring it back down, restacking, and let's just continue that work, feeling that transition of weight from one side to the other, feeling how the core, those obliques have to balance you out. Careful that you don't get into those shoulders. I'm kind of catching myself doing it. Do one more time on each side, rolling it back. Good, coming back up, last time here, we roll it back. Good, coming back up, take a moment here, take your hands to the base of your TerraGlide. Now, I have short arms, so I know you can do this. You're gonna grab underneath that TerraGlide, grip it tight, you're gonna bring your legs together, and let's curl that pelvis under. I want you to roll it back, probably just to that lumbar spine hold. Scoop that belly, think pubic bone to the sternum as you drag your toes towards your bottom. You're gonna roll back to the tips of your shoulder blades as your legs come to your table top position. Holy guacamole. Hold it there. I'm shaking. Can you take your hands to the front of the TerraGlide? Draw your knees back. Hold it. Whoo! We're going to dip one toe down. Bring it up and switch. Dip the other toe down and bring it up. Oh, yes. Lots of balance challenge here. Bring it up. Dip it down. Bring it up. I'm having a hard time here. If I bring my knees any further back, I'm going to go falling. Last one here, bring it up, hold it here, hold it. Can you take your arms and balance? Ooh. Can you straighten the leg and switch and switch? I know I'm ridiculous and switch. If it's too much, hold on to that terror glide. Last four and three, 
Last two. One more. Bring your legs together. Rock yourself up. Woo, sit nice and tall. Lovely. Good. Take a moment here. We're going to switch it up a little bit here. So I'm going to have you take both hands to one thigh. Hold it there. Curl it under. You're rolling straight back. Hold it. Mm -hmm. Hold it. You're going to draw that leg to your tabletop. Hold it. Find it. What if you change legs and switch? Grab it. Hold it. Uh-huh. Change legs. Switch again. Now, when you're changing, make sure you rotate your torso with it and change. Oh, my goodness. And switch. The balance challenge is real here, yes? And switch. Good. We have four and three. Last two. One more. Good. Bring the feet down. Come back up. Restack that spine. Nice. Oh, and there's my cat. He wants to play. <laughs> we're gonna come up. Hi, are you up from your nap? There you go. All right, so we're gonna take this guy, turn it around so it's facing you. Let's go right into some back extension, yeah? One of my favorites, and I actually do this on the BOSU too. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that TerraGlide right underneath the pelvis, okay? And the way I find the proper position is I start in my extension here and I lift my toes to make sure that I can effortless, effortlessly lift them up without a struggle, right? So if there's a struggle, chances are you have to move your legs a little more forward um, so that the glide is lower down on your legs. So you're here. Wrap at the shoulder, so externally rotate the shoulder. Think elbow creases forward. We're gonna keep the toes tucked under. Lift the collarbones, pull up the belly, and just bend the elbow. So we're gonna go into a little tricep push-up, if you will, and then come up into a swan, yeah? So we bend, inhale, and exhale, press. Again, inhale, and exhale, press. One more like that, inhale, exhale, press. Now with that, there's a little fold that happens at your hip, yes? But what if we lift our toes off the mat, hold that, and without folding at the hip, we actually bring the legs with us, and we come up. We inhale, bring it down, exhale, up. Two more like that. And then we're gonna play around with taking a contact point off the floor. What if we go down again and take one arm by the ear? What? Oh, there's the balance. And again, other arm. Woo, yes. It's kind of challenging. Lift. And again. If at any time that becomes too challenging, you can tuck your toes. Oh. I think that's even harder <laughs> to take that contact point away. Do one more time each side. Last one. Bring it down. Relax your legs. Press it back. Little child's pose. Round it out. Whew. Yes. And then we're going to push the sky forward to the front of your mat. And then I want you to take a moment here. We're going to do a little modified push-up. Well, modified plank, push up, I lied. So we are going to come onto our forearms and you're actually gonna take your arms like this. So you're gonna use the width of the TerraGlide and we're gonna place them onto the TerraGlide here. So elbows are under our shoulders. Now you're here, we're gonna take the legs into a modified plank. Now maybe you're like Heidi, I can do a little bit more than this, then that's totally fine. Then you come up and find your plank position, okay? So we're gonna hold right here. Now, if you're modifying, we're gonna go into a side plank. You're gonna let your legs tip to one side, open up that arm, come back to center, and then we switch. So we tip the legs, 
open up the arm, bring it back to center. Now, if you're not modifying, I'm gonna join you. We come up, we rotate the feet, we open it up, and we bring it back to center. And then we switch. Rotate, push out of that elbow, right? Your elbow's gonna sink down, so you have to really think of pulling out of your shoulder. Yes, rotate, open, and we bring it back. Rotate, we open, and we bring it back. We're gonna hold this one, open it up, hold. You're gonna take that bottom leg, can you kick it forward and bring it back? If you're modifying, you can just stay there. Two more, kick it forward, bring it back. One more, bring it back and back to center. Other side, open it up. Take that bottom leg, kick it forward, bring it back. Last two, kick it forward, bring it back. Woo! One more, bring it back, back to center. Yes, lower your knees, press it back. Very good, now. Here's the fun stuff, yeah? The fun stuff. We're gonna flip it over. Now, it gets more interesting, yes? So, we're gonna use the handles, which is so awesome for those who might have wrist issues. So great on the wrist. So, we're here. You're gonna go ahead and hold those handles here. Let's start modified, and then I'll progress. Yes, I promise. I always progress. So, we're gonna bring the knees back, find your modified plank, pull up on that belly. All I want you to do here is just tip the TerraGlide forward and pull it back, yeah? As it goes forward, notice what happens in the center body. Notice what happens in the back body, right? Bring it back. One more like that. Bring it back. <laughs> There's OJ. Come back to center, hold. Now from here, we're gonna push down with one arm. So we're gonna keep that arm straight and we are gonna bend the opposite elbow. Bring it back, I know it's weird. Do the other side. So the elbow bends, we push down with the opposite arm. Bring it back to center. Do that again. So we bend and push, bring it back. Now I do a version of this using the underside of the balanced body arc. You can check that out as well. Yes, so we press and bring it back. Good, now take a moment, press it back, relax your wrists, and then of course, of course we're gonna add on to this, okay? If you're like, nope, that was enough for me, you can stay in your modified position. Otherwise, you're gonna join me, we're here. We're gonna step it back, find this nice plank position. You're solid here. Hold it. Let's tip that TerraGlide forward and pull it back. Again, tip it forward and tip it back. Tip it forward. Hi, OJ. And back. <laughs> One more time, forward. He's in a playful mood. And back. Come back to center, hold it here, hold. Now, here's where it gets dicey. Can you push it away, bend the opposite elbow? Bring it back to center. And then push, bring it back to center. We push, bring it back to center. You got it, push, bring it back. One more set, push. Woo. One more. Good, lower your knees, press it back. Now we're gonna add on to that, yes? Go. <laughs> we're gonna add on. So from here, we're gonna come back onto your all fours position for a moment. Try to keep your hips right where they are in the space, okay? And we're gonna walk it back again. Remember, you can always modify and just Keep your knees on the floor. We're here. Now, as you push down, let's do everyone on the right side. You're gonna push down with the right, bend the left elbow. You're gonna pull that right knee into the elbow, obliques, and then bring it back to center. And then switch, push down with the left, left knee comes up to the elbow, and then bring it back. Again, push, bring it back, and we push. 
and bring it back. Almost forgot to bend that elbow. Push, bring it back. And we push, bring it back. Hold it here, little jackrabbit. We press the hips back. Shoot it forward. Whoo! Push it back. Shoot it forward. One more like that. Push it back. Shoot it forward. Hold it there. Three more sets here. Elbow to knee and back or knee to elbow. Whoo! Last four and three. Last two. Last one. Bring it down. And rest, relax your hands, relax your wrists. Woo. So I have used this with my clients already and, and I noticed too, it could be a little more cushiony on the, or on the hands, on the handles, but it's still great. <laughs> yeah, take a moment there, flip it back over. Woo, a quick little core workout here, have a seat. Take your legs out in front of you. Little spine stretch, feet as wide as your chair glide maybe, yeah? Take your arms out in front, take a breath in. Exhale, nod the chin, round the spine, pull the belly wall back, find that nice stretch. Roll yourself up, finding the posture. Take the hands, bring them behind the head. Same kind of thing here, roll it down. Mm-hmm. Now lengthen the spine, lift the heart. Big extension, hello back body, hamstrings, back extensors, round it forward. Roll it up. So a little spinal movement here. One more time, just like that, rolling it down. Inhale, lengthen, find that energy line through the head, through the tailbone, dive it back forward. Roll it back up. Take a moment here, take the arms up to the sky. Flex the wrists, and you're gonna lift the heart. Good. There it is. A quick Pilates-based workout using your Terraglide. I promise there's a lot more where this came from. Please comment below if you have questions, and I hope to see you again at my next video. OJ, picked the wrong time to play. <laughs> Say hi. I'm ready for my video. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he was bringing the ball to me because he wanted to play. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really hope you liked this video. Give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget. Subscribe and you'll be notified when the next video drops. And in the meantime, come join me on Instagram. I hope to see you soon. <laughs>